In today's video, we're gonna be talking about everything that you need to know in order to start drop shipping CBD. CBD, CBD, CBD oil. CBD lotion for her back. Wait, you mean that we're gonna be drop shipping? What? No, no. <laughs> yep, that's exactly what we're gonna be talking about. What? No, man, no, go away. We're talking about CBD. So simply put, cannabis is split into two different parts for the most part. When it comes to the different things that you can ingest, there's gonna be two different parts to it. There's gonna be the one that has less than 0.3% THC, which is gonna be the CBD. CBD is 100% legal, depending on where you're drop shipping it from. The other part is gonna be whatever is over 0.3% THC, in which case it can cause inebriation or for people to pretty much, you know, get high. But again, that's not what we're drop shipping. We're not drop shipping the high THC parts. We're drop shipping the low THC parts, which will not cause any psychedelic effects, which is CBD. Now, for the most part, CBD will be used in quite a few different ways, but there is not going to be any psychedelic effect because of such a low amount of THC. That's why in countries such as the US and Europe, it's legal to drop ship or legal to sell. Now, regardless of whatever country you decide to drop ship CBD in, you always want to make sure with your local laws that you're following every single rule. This is still somewhat of a sensitive topic, depending on where you you are and you want to make sure you do everything by the book while it is legal to do it you want to do things the right way you need to follow the rule now in the us and europe it is again completely legal to sell but in any other country make sure you do correct and deep research because you want to make sure that what you're selling is ultimately legal but for this video we are going to be focusing particularly on the us and europe now what makes drop shipping cbd so lucrative what makes it so profitable well for one since it is somewhat still of a regulated space it is going to be a lot less saturated than any other category out there. So you're not going to have a lot of competition. On top of that, it's a new market. It's still something that's coming up, but it's not so new that it's taboo. CBD and cannabis at this point in the US and Europe has become pretty accepted. It's no longer something that people shy away from. It's no longer something that people are afraid of. And really in these two countries, the more the time passes, the more regular it's going to become. At this point, honestly, it's pretty much become like having a beer. Shipping is also super easy and super cheap. Since most of the items are going to be fairly small and lightweight, it's not going to cost a lot to ship them. And best part is we're not going to be shipping these internationally. The suppliers that we're going to be talking about in this video are all going to be local suppliers. And last but not least, since a lot of people like to use this recreationally or for health reasons, most of the times what's going to end up happening is if you have a good product, people are going to make the purchase. And once they use it, once they finish whatever they're using, they're going to come back and purchase more. So you really have the potential for repeat customers. So how do you get started drop shipping CBD? Well, the first thing you need to do is register your company. Now, what you're going to do with this is check out a website called CBD Boxes. And on there, you're going to get all of the information that you need on whatever you need to actually register your company. Now, my recommendation, you can do this yourself. You can register the company yourself with your state, with your country or wherever it is. But personally, when it comes to things like this, I would rather hire a professional. It's better to make sure you get these things done right and get them done right the first time than to keep spending more money or potentially get in trouble because something was done wrong. Listen, even when I first started going into business for myself, and I started my first business. It was a simple printing company, printing t-shirts. I did not register my business by myself. I did everything online. I used the service called LegalZoom, which is absolutely fantastic. They took care of literally everything. I did not have to worry about one thing. Honestly, one of the things I was most scared about was registering my company wrong. So if you wanna make sure that everything's done right and you wanna make sure that you don't have any issues or any hiccups along the way, make sure you hire a professional. So after that, after you have your company registered, the next thing you wanna do is set up your shop. Now, you're not going to be selling CBD on Etsy or eBay or Amazon. These different platforms are going to completely outright ban you. They do not allow this kind of drop shipping. They don't, I think, even allow these kinds of products on their platforms, period. So your best option is going to be Shopify. Now, one great thing about Shopify is the fact that you don't have to commit to them right away. You can get started with just $1 each month for three months. So you have a pretty extended trial period. Now, if you want access to that, just go ahead and check out the link down below. The link to the Shopify trial will be in the description. Description. Also, speaking about the description down below, there is going to be a relevant article to everything that I'm talking about on there. All of the different links, including the CBD box link, is going to be down in the description below in the article. So make sure you check that out once you're done with this video. So once you have your store set up with Shopify, the next thing you need to do is provide them with an attestation, letting them know that you're working with payment providers that accept payment for hemp derived products, such as CBD. Now, this is important to know because there are going to be some payment providers that will not accept these types of payments because of the product itself. 
But again, since we're working with CBD, this is something that's a lot more common and something that most payment providers are going to ultimately accept. But before you do get started selling, you do need to register and you need to let Shopify know that you're doing this. Now, more info on that will be in the article down below. Also, I'm going to have an easy to reference cheat sheet with everything that I'm talking about in this video, including all of the different links. So you're going to have the option to either check out the article or check out the cheat sheet. Now, if you want access to the cheat sheet, all you have to do is go ahead and comment down below hashtag CBD dropshipping and let me know what you think of CBD. What do you think about selling it? Do you think it's something that can be potentially very lucrative or is it something that you plan to stay away from? Let me know down in the comments below. I would love to hear your thoughts. Okay, so now we know everything that we actually need to be informed about regarding starting our Shopify store. Now, the next thing that we need to do is figure out what kind of products are we going to be selling? What are the different CBD products that we can offer? Now for this, there are seven main products that you can be selling or offering your customers. And to start, the first one is going to be CBD flowers. CBD flowers are just that. They are CBD in its natural form, in the form of a plant, or at least a certain part of the plant that gets broken down and ingested. The way it's ingested can be either through vaping or through smoking. Aside from that, there's also CBD vaping oil, which as we all know right now, everyone vapes nicotine. So it's only natural that they're going to have CBD vaping oils. These oils also tend to be more concentrated, so they are going to be stronger than the typical flower. Aside from that, there's also CBD capsules, so people can take CBD in the form of a pill. There's also CBD for pets. These typically come in the form of treats. I've actually given my dog CBD treats in the past, primarily when he gets nervous whenever there's fireworks or anything outside. What it does is it gives them a nice calming sensation and it relieves any anxiety. There's also CBD snacks and edibles for people, which this is something that a lot of people have to be careful with because if you eat too much, it can start to give you some unwanted effects. Now, one extremely popular product when it comes to CBD is going to be skincare and beauty products. You're going to find a lot of different creams, a lot of different topical ointments, all with CBD. The point behind these is going to be the same. For the most part, it's going to be either some sort of relaxation or some sort of pain relief. And last but not least, sprays and tin cures. These are pretty much going to be the same thing as edible CBD, except it's going to come in the form of a spray or a little tin cure that you're just going to drop in your mouth and wait for the effects. Now, one extremely important tip that I need to give you whenever you're vetting your different suppliers is going to be to always, 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 please always ask for certification. All these different CBD companies are always going to have different lab tests and different certifications. So make sure you ask them for a copy so that way you know who you're going into business with. And more importantly, you know for a fact that the products that you're selling are safe. So now that we've got all of that out of the way, let's go ahead and start talking about some of the top suppliers for CBD products. And the first one is going to be Joy Organics. Now, what makes Joy Organics stand out is the fact that they have so many benefits and so many features. For one, they offer literally every single product that I talked about. So as you can see here, you have a little bit of everything from tin cures to gummies and more. Aside from that, Joy Organics also has a wholesale program and they also have a private label program. So you can brand your own CBD products. Another awesome feature about Joy Organics is the fact that they have a loyalty program. So the more you purchase, the more you save. Next up, we have Charlotte's Web. Now, Charlotte's Web offers all of the different products that we mentioned, except for CBD flour. They also offer free shipping on orders over $75, which honestly, with products like this, it's pretty easy to get to, especially because people are typically ordering more than one or two different products. And one more thing I want to point out about Charlotte's Web is right here, looking at their website. If you look under the About Us section, you can find their certificate of analysis. This is exactly what I was talking about earlier that you need to get from your different suppliers. Now, when it comes to these certificates, you, there are going to be a lot. They're going to be for each product. And the easiest way to do this is simply by searching up the lot number, which once you start doing business with these companies, you're going to learn a little bit more about their lot numbers because you're going to be seeing them more often as you place your orders. Absolute Nature CBD is up next in our third spot, and they are considered to be one of the top 10 companies selling CBD oils. So that means that their CBD oil is pretty high quality. Now, Absolute CBD offers a little bit of everything so they're going to offer oils, gummies, topicals, flowers, and CBD for pets. Now, to give you somewhat of an idea of some of their pricing when it comes to things like flowers, you can see here that they can range anywhere from $10 all the way up to $100. Now, of course, this is going to depend on the amount that is purchased. Typically, these are going to be sold by grams. In our fourth spot, we have CBD Essence. And CBD Essence offers free shipping on orders over $49. Now, CBD Essence is going to be offering you things like tin cures, capsules, topicals, vapes, and CBD for pets. So they're not going to be selling the actual flower. Now, one great thing about CBD essence is the fact that they actually have a return program. So if there's any issues with the product, you can always submit for a return or an exchange. Now to do this is a little bit different than you typically would for any other store. What you're going to have to do is you're actually gonna have to submit a request to them first. Then you have to get an RMA or a return merchant.
merchandise authorization. And then if they ask for it, then you're gonna have to ship the product back. After that, then you'll be able to get your money back. Now, I know that seems like a little bit of a process, but for a product like CBD, returns are practically unheard of. So this is actually really good. And last but not least, when it comes to our top suppliers for CBD dropshipping, we have ecosciences.com. Now, ecosciences, once again, is like some of the other ones, and they're gonna offer everything except for the flower. They also have a dropshipping program, a wholesale program, and if you're up for it, and if it's something that you like, you can also become an affiliate. Now that you have everything set up for your store, you know what you're gonna be selling, and you know where you're gonna be sourcing your products from, the next thing that you need to focus on is gonna be your marketing. This is still a fairly niched and unique product. So make sure your marketing reflects that. Make sure you have some new marketing techniques, something different, something creative, something that can grab people's attention. CBD is full of the two things that we're always looking for, value to someone's life and a wow factor. The value is always gonna be some sort of relief, whether it be pain, anxiety, depression, whatever it is. And that can also serve as the wow factor. So when you're marketing your products, make sure to try to get creative, think outside of the box, or even reach out to people on Fiverr. You can reach out to a creative marketer, talk to them about your product, let them know what you're trying to do, and they can get back to you with a few different ideas. Aside from that, if all else fails, grab your phone, start recording a couple TikToks, and demonstrating the product on there. Of course, when it comes to TikTok, you are going to have to be a bit cautious, so you're not really going to be able to vape or smoke them, but there's definitely a few different ways around that. You can always talk about the product. You can talk about the effects. There really are tons of different ways that you can market these products. So just get creative and start thinking outside of the box. The last thing that's really left to wrap up this entire thing and show your customers that you really do care about them and you want the best for them is to give the best possible customer service. Remember, we're drop shippers, so we are going to have questions left and right. And all of our different customers are going to want answers quick. They're not going to want to wait more than one day. So always try to answer any questions, any concerns, any emails at a maximum of 24 hours. Anytime after that, more than likely our customers either already forgot about us or they made their purchase somewhere else. Now, remember everything that I talked about in today's video, I'm going to have in an easy to reference cheat sheet. And to get access to that, all you have to do is go ahead and comment down below, hashtag CBD dropshipping, and let me know what you think of this particular niche. Let me know what you think of dropshipping CBD. I really want to hear your thoughts about this because this is a pretty unique product to talk about so let me know down in the comments below aside from that everything is also going to be in the article which is going to be in the description down below now if you found this video helpful if you found it informational if you enjoyed listening to me talk then make sure you smash that like button and while you're there make sure you subscribe so that way you don't miss out on any future videos huge thank you once again to everyone for watching especially if you made it all the way to the end once again my name is mario with AutoDS, and i'll catch you all next time